All right, in today's video, I am going to take a look at my Black & Decker 14-inch Weave Eater, which I purchased from Home Depot for about $50, and now it's starting to fail on me, where the switch doesn't work when it's supposed to. You can click the switch, and sometimes it doesn't work. Most of the time it doesn't work, and then when I do get it to work, I just hold it, hold it in that spot while it's working, and then it stops working, and I need it to work to where I can press the button, release, press, release, press, release. I don't want to work first try. So when you depress this, that then causes that to move. Sometimes it doesn't go all the way, see? Or it's up too high. Anyway, I gotta tighten that up. Alright, I'm going to plug this in and test if that switch works all the time when it's activated or not. We'll see. Kind of need to elevate that other side. Put it up on the box there. Maybe that'll do something. Now let's try activating. So you can see if it gets loose. thinking of doing this metal plate came off so I'm thinking about lifting this up by putting this plate doubling it up just put this plate in there to give it a little more lift I think that's all I need to do. One could argue that all I really needed to do was tighten up the screws before I even started this project. But the screws were already tight.
Job's done. Better than factory.